people don't listen, it really pisses me off. And we wrote a song about it. It's called Shut Up or Die. <coughs> and it goes like this. my demise asking why do we die and why does everything change a sage told me we're all just like dew on the grass we're like little lambs walking to the slaughterhouse he said nothing less but somehow everything lasts because we are this constantly changing mosaic held together with the force of opposing forces the force of opposing forces we are the good and the bad of it we are the down and the up of it, the finite and the infinite. And all this matters and it don't. It matters and it don't, because my empty desolation transforms. It becomes my sweet intoxication, like murder becomes creation. Murder becomes creation. Death and eternity, death and eternity. Sometimes they're just pulling me, pulling me till I give up and I'm curled up, contemplating a desire for death, yet my incorrigible life force always forces itself through and through till I am gulping from the cup of life. Right now I am gulping from the cup of life and I am desperately alone. I need some fucking time alone. I am so confident, I need constant validation and I crave my lifelong mate. I am independent, completely fulfilled. I am always hungry. I am always hungry. All joy and laughter. <laughs> Till I'm silent, 
frozen, then my passion's unknown, unspoken, and I'm the melancholy court jester, the silent poet, the actor who cannot move, green wonder woman, consuming claim that fuck it, we can't be in this dirty world and not be of it, because I am a constantly changing mosaic, held together with the force of opposing forces, and you are a constantly changing mosaic, held together with a force of opposing forces, the force of opposing forces, and we are this constantly changing mosaic, held together with the force of opposing forces. Okay, now that things are a little bit more intimate, I feel like, and there's not that, but you know, it's intimate. I can tell you about my personal life. Because I can't afford therapy right now. This shit's expensive. <laughs> is it just me? All right, there's, all right, is it just me? Or is a guy a little hotter if he just like treats you a little wrong? I just, don't let it, just, it's just me. It's just, just, you know, I'm sorry. Just a little, just a little. All right. Well, I'm going to tell you all about the best boy. The best boy I ever dated.
you. So, believe it or not, um, I've been accused of being a jealous person. No I'm, way! I'm not. I'm not at all. I'm loving, open, accepting. Right, Kelly? Uh -huh. Yeah, not jealous at all. Right, Mitch? <laughs> yeah. Right? <laughs> so, alright, well, I wrote a song about how not jealous I am, okay? It's called I Hate Your Ex-Girlfriend. Just kidding, it's fine. So sing along once you learn it. I love 
when you leave. I love it when you come. I love it when you leave. I like it when you come. I love it when you leave. I like it when you come. Bad, 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 baby, come with me. When it should it be the devil's girlfriend? No, I hate your ex girl. No, so I, I got a Joni Mitchell song. Uh, this guy's song about getting high now. Oh, we have any party people in the crowd? We got a crowd of party people, is the idea. At a certain point tonight, I might, I might get to a certain point where I want to make an inappropriate phone call. Are you gonna let me make that inappropriate phone call? I sure as hell will. <laughs> <laughs> this is called I Want to Call You When I Get Really High. I want to call you when I get really high. I want to call you when I'm losing my mind. I want to call you when I'm tripping like this. To say the things that I'll never admit. Shit told me that the rides were the smoke. I go on and cook with something to do. The room is flashy, all your people are cool. The crowd is focused on the what I'm thinking of you. Because I wanna call you when I get really high. I wanna call you when I'm losing my mind. I 
wanna call you, but look at the time. We're all together, Kelly's laughing like a sin. Roll the towel, pants, put together. Kitchen cats are deep inside and it's long. I love the crazy rhythm, but I love it more. And it pulls me, come join us in bed. Silky sheets and the hundred can thread. One more hit, thank you, use a shit hand. But the truth of that grabs my hat. And now he wants head. I wanna call you when I get really hot I wanna call you when I'm losing my mind I wanna call you but look at the time I... Hey there honey, could you please call me back? Took the blue pill and the shit's really white Floors are sloping sideways, walls got crazy cracks I'm having trouble breathing I wanna call you when I get really high I wanna call you when I'm losing my mind I wanna call you but look at the time I wanna call you when I'm getting undressed I feel my heart pound right through my chest Don't you FaceTime me now I'm a mess Cause I, I wanna call you when I get really high I wanna call you when I'm losing my mind. I wanna call you, but look at the time. I, I wanna call you when I'm thoroughly baked. Was it the cookies, all the brownies, all the cookies, all the brownies? I still need the are fictional but you know it's you know it's not fictional you know it's not fictional guys uh, having sex with aliens there's nothing fictional about that this is basically a, this is biographical <laughs> about having sex with aliens. <laughs> You're gonna like every second of it. You'll love every All second right. of it. <laughs> oh. Fuck the goddamn pokies. 
So even at the Anti-Folk Festival, I'm still, all right, this is where the edge is. I'm still getting some looks. Maybe you don't understand the appeal of having an alien as a lover. Maybe you just need someone to explain it to you. You see, these aliens, all right, aliens, they travel from light years away to explore. You know what I mean. They're not gonna say no to anything I suggest, you know. For example, if I say something like, hey, Ellen, I love you. You make me feel really good, but I think it might be even better if we invited some of your friends to join us. Now, Ellen's not gonna get all psychological on me, like, I'm not gonna name any names, okay? Because you guys know each other, but like some people will. He's not gonna say something like, what, Lauren? What happened to you as a child that might cause you to suggest such a thing? You're obviously fucked up. You should seek counseling. Alien's not gonna say anything like that. An alien's not gonna get all insecure and say something like, What, Lauren? Aren't my penises big enough for you? Oh, no. Alien's gonna start dialing. That's right. Alien sex. What's my alien sex? Alien sex, she wants an alien sex. Oh, we got a sex to play. Let's get a pray. Alien sex, what's an alien sex? Alien sex, what's an alien sex? Oh, we got a sex to play. Let's get a pray. Let's get a pray. Let's get a pray. Let's get a pray! Folk Festival. Happy Anti-Folk Festival. Thank you, Ann Hussick, for letting us play here. We're really, really honored. Ann is playing next, and after her, one of my favorite people in the universe, Kelly Mockstar Dwyer. Yeah. yeah. How many more we have left? Uh, five minutes or one, I guess. <laughs> for the Ramones, that would be three. Yeah, I right know. Um, ladies and gentlemen, you guys are listening to Lauren O'Brien and Mitch Evans to Stefano. To Stefano. Oh. Be all. You know what? Actually, I'm Lauren O'Brien, that's Mitch DiStefano. We have a mailing list. Oh, that's Lauren O'Brien. That's <laughs> Lauren. I'm Mitch. I'm Mitch now. Well, we have a mailing list. Well, I'm coming out with the mailing tip jar for these guys. Here's how we do not charge cover. We pass the jar around for the artists. That's how you get paid. There's a $5 suggested donation. Please get some money ready. Put your hands together one more time for Lauren O'Brien and Mitch DiStefano. People, I read auras, and your auras are completely fucked up. You have a lot of problems, but you're enjoying your lives. That's my oh, reading of the room. Yeah. And this song is special for you. The chorus is easy, and you're smart, fucked up motherfuckers. So you're gonna learn it. It's called Trauma is the Spice to Life, and there's just that one line in the chorus, so you'll learn it fast and sing along. Oh, yeah. Once I get my capo out Once of get my case. Put it on. Let's watch Mitch put it on. Yeah. Do it. Third it's friend. important to make sure you put yeah, your capo it. on correctly. This, Mitch also teaches for, lessons. For musical satisfaction. Right behind the fret line. So you don't so. have any leakage or, you know, bum <laughs> notes. Make we it hate tight. bum notes. Make it tight. Some guys can't, don't get it on the right spot. Put it in the right spot. They're like two. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> They're only a block away. They're ready for you. I'm ready for you. <laughs> I didn't say right now. Maybe your parents always got drunk and stoned.